My name is Tim, and I'm going to show you how to install the U.S. International Keyboard, which will enable you to type accents in foreign languages. After you've installed the keyboard, then watch my other video, How to Use the U.S. International Keyboard. Okay, first you can check to see if you already have the keyboard installed. I'm on my desktop here. Go down to your status bar, and if you have a rectangle that looks like a keyboard, then it's already installed, and you can left-click on it and find if you have the U.S. International Keyboard there. Okay, I do not have the rectangular keyboard icon. So, first go to your Windows Start button in the lower left. Click on that. Open the Control Panel. Now find the icon that says Regional and Language, or Clock Regional and Language. It looks like a blue globe with a clock in front of it. Click on that twice, left click. And then go up and select the Keyboard and Languages tab. And then select change keyboards and this will show you what keyboards you have installed. I have just the usual default keyboard for people in the US. It's going to be it's this right here. It just says US. So move your cursor right to click on the add button. Left click and then you get a list of all the languages. Scroll down to English and then if there's a plus sign on English United States click on that plus sign to the left of the word English and then you'll see the keyboards and go down to uh, the fourth one down here. It says United States International. See? So select that. That's the one we want to add. So after you have that selected, United States dash International, then click on OK. And then now you can see you have the U.S. keyboard, the standard keyboard, and the United States International. So click on Apply, and then click on OK. And then you can just exit out of these windows. Now we're back at the desktop. Now just go down to your status bar, and now you should have a rectangle that is the keyboard selector. So right now it's set at US and you can left click on it and select between United States International and US. See my next video, How to Use the United States International Keyboard.